Hello everyone, it's Bubonic Zombie. Welcome back to House of a Thousand Doors, the Palm of Zoraster. So we are, we opened, we got the two eyes of the gargoyle to open this door to the rest of the house. Let's go. Okay. Another fireball. I just saw another fireball. Was it looking for something? I'm starting to think they're sentient. They behave like living creatures. Perhaps a wizard or a demon controls them. I'm gonna guess demon. Oh, what is this? A puzzle. Central part is missing. Does it need a gear? No. Does it need a dragon? No. Okay. What's this? Piece is missing. Piece is missing everywhere. As soon as I think about a door, it disappears. It's gonna get me anywhere. Is the house in a bad mood today? Will that happen? Maybe it is in a bad mood. Okay. That's a break. I have a gear. I have no idea which way we're supposed to be facing. Oh! Stairs! Okay. A pipe organ. This is what we saw at the beginning of the game okay missing a key okay hope it's not a memory game I'm not good at memory games magical might go there I don't have anything magical that dragon head. Okay. Anywhere else I can go. Back to the garden. Okay. Ah, the rake to rake up the leaves. Organ key. There we go. People scattering their stuff all over the place. Okay. Here is your key. Ah. Tibet key. Looks like we're going to to Tibet. We are going to Tibet. Okay. Oh, hello. Hello, Catherine. I knew you'd come to help us. It all started when that weird organ appeared out of nowhere. Uncle Gabriel, who paid for my classical music lessons, asked me to play something by Bach or Handel. When I touched the keys, everything around us burst into flames and the fireballs appeared. Please help us. I'm afraid of fire after what happened with that cursed portrait. Also, Gabriel asked me to restore the paintings in the corridor. You might have seen them on your way here. 
You must think they're connected to the fireballs. By the way, if you're wondering what she meant uh, by cursed portrait, in the last game there was a cursed portrait um, that kind of paid homage to the crying boy. I talk about more about that in the episode but she had a cursed portrait and we had to help the soul of the girl that was painted in the portrait amanda poor amanda she must have been scared to death when the fireballs appeared at least i know the fireballs are connected to that strange organ other things seem to be tied to it as well. For example, Gabriel asked the girl to restore the paintings in the corridor. I believe these are all links. These are all links on the same chain. All I need to do is figure out what's tying them together. Yeah, so Amanda also restores paintings. She's a painter herself. But let's see. This key. Okay. <laughs> Looks like we're jumping in. Okay. Oh, hello. Ghost. It's a ghost. Who is he? He looks like a Tibetan monk. Which brings up an interesting question. Where am I? Wait a minute. I can't believe it. It's the Tibetan monastery I saw in Saman's book. Our magician has created more new worlds. I imagine he had a reason. Perhaps Gabriel asked him to, asked him to. Regardless, it's time for me to talk with the spirit. Okay. The ghost didn't say a word, he just vanished. Yep. Okay. Temple of the Sleeping Buddha. The Temple of the Sleeping Buddha is an amazing place. One of only a few in Tibet tourists one of only a few in Tibet tourists are not allowed to visit security officers guarded which is strange because who would go there of their own free will people say the ghosts of monks who were burned alive there centuries ago haunt the temple back then an unknown power appeared and the holy men went crazy and slaughtered one another fun No, I don't want to. Okay. So, hidden object scene. Ooh, pretty. Oh, it's right here. Okay. We have a reed. Oh, this. Are you dead? That's the skeleton of a Buddhist monk still sitting where he was killed. What happened here? Okay, so we're not creepy. Can I take your scimitar? No, okay. It's a rock, a lock, and something shiny down there. Missing a charm. What's up here? Another dead Buddhist monk. Why are they all covered with thick layer of soot? The buildings look fine. Maybe they were burned? That's a pure scimitar. No. Okay. We have rope. Two star shaped objects in order to open the lock. Maybe the giant's a clue what the keys look like. Like this. Okay. 
Can we find out where that dragon key? Oh, it's a red panda! What a cute animal is holding something in his paws. How can I get it? Do I have anything to exchange? No. But it's a red panda! Oh, look, it's wagging his tail! Okay. Pouch to carry the cherry tree petals. Okay. Okay. Ah, trap heart. Where can we go? Okay, we're needed right here. Holding something in its paw. No. This one's holding like a ball. No, it's not that. Okay. Wanna read? Yay! <laughs> oh, he's so cute! Okay. Locket. Oh, that is the locket that belongs to the statue that's back in the other world, right here. Locket. Oh. Mouse figurine. Okay. Another hidden object scene. Okay. Film projector. Ah, oh, it's missing the other reel. I saw that it had the other reel the last time. Okay, here it is. Reel to reel. Film projector. Okay. Okay. There's the bicycle horn. We just need the anchor now. Is it a picture of an anchor or is it an actual anchor? Okay. We have a chisel. Where to now? Back to Tibet. Okay, can we use this? We need something to hammer. Oh, rock. That works. There are more dead bodies down there. We have rope. Great. Stone this sphere. And they mean fire. Symbols mean fire and death. Lovely. Okay. Fire and death. What happened here? What strange power made the monks go crazy and spill each other's blood? Skeletons are everywhere. Their clothes are okay, but their bones are covered with ash, as though they burn from within. I also found a scroll with the symbols of for fire and death. Are they connected to the fireballs in the house? I would reckon so. Okay, but we can go here. You near the sphere. What's that? Took other spot. Nope. Matches? Nope. Okay. Red Panda. Okay. We need to go here to the main hall.
Ooh, ooh. Here we go. Simple image by rotating its rings. Click and drag a ring to rotate it. Okay. Where do they start? Okay. Good, they lock in. Okay. Okay, base it around the center one. I get it now. There's another key. Okay. Where else do we need to go? Still need to do stuff here in the main hall. Okay. Oh. Does this go here? No. Okay. How about here? Yes. Okay, and we will see what is on the other side of that door in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye!